Have you ever had one of those sleepless nights? It's like one in the morning and I haven't fallen asleep. I'm sure you've had one of those for various reasons. I hope you guys are well. I hope you all are sleeping and having sweet dreams. I'm going to give it another try. So I'm still here. 2 a.m. I might try the read the book thing until you fall asleep. I have a few books I need to read, so. It's morning time. I slept a little bit. I'm going to make a sticker that says, do it tired. You know, sometimes you just got to get up and do it tired. Get some coffee and get moving. coffee flowing through thy veins. Something about the morning, that first cup of coffee, those first couple sips, those eggs frying, that bacon, sausage, hash browns, you know, whatever, cooking up, just filling the house with those aromas just gets you pumped. This morning was pretty rough. I was like, ugh. But you know, I find that once I get out of bed and I take a shower, get that hot water running, or get that coffee brewing, those breakfast smells, it just livens me up. We had to take a pit stop here before we can go out on this adventure. All right, y'all peeps. I'm trying to stay out of the light because it's so bright out here. So you guys can see me and I don't look like a ghost, but we have arrived at the spot. So you can see behind me some water and hear some honking geese. And don't worry, I'm not going to shoot the geese. I'm going to catch the fish in the pond. That is the goal. So this time last year, I went fishing for the first time back after the military and doing some missionary work. And uh, I caught my first bass here at this little dirty pond. It was about a three pounder and it was about this time of year. Not really the best time for bass fishing at all, but not impossible to catch them. I love all kinds of fishing, but I really, uh, just got pretty stoked about bass fishing after that and started to catch a bunch of them. And so I fish all the time. I just haven't brought you guys along with me. So let's go see if we can catch a bass, hopefully more than one. Let's get out there. We have made it to the spot. If I catch one today, I think it'll be a miracle. But we'll see. So. A little different here. Let's see what happens here. Nothing. Hmm. There's another guy fishing over there. Hey, I went fishing. First time 2019. Didn't catch anything. When your line is in the water, there's always a chance any second a fish can bite. And just that anticipation is what keeps me casting um, and oftentimes staying way longer. Today, I was already uh, anticipating that it was going to be difficult. And even the guy I just talked to uh, who brought his boat in, he said he didn't catch anything. Um, it was just a slow day. And he was out there a lot longer than I was. So 
Anyways, beautiful sunset here in Oregon. It's a wonderful place. Get outside, guys. Get out there and explore. Bundle up. It's cold. But I just encourage you, breathe some fresh air. Take a break. Enjoy God's creation that we have for the time that we're here on Earth. And uh, just so thankful for the opportunity today to go fishing. Love to fish. I hope whatever you're doing, whatever time of day you're watching this, this video finds you well. And I will see you guys again on the next one. God bless you. Thank <laughs> you.